Are there any rumblings as to what next season might look like? We're still waiting to hear. I think they're doing some casting and, you know, it's going to be a little shake up, which I'm think I I'm okay with. I think it's needed. Well, you don't have anything to worry about. I hope not. <laughs> you don't. No way. Oh, just ask any T or RHOA you can share with us. Other than they still haven't told everybody who they bring back. Yeah, they over here, they being real, uh, real tripping. Because they act like people don't have a life. People got lives around here. We got to make plans for other things. So by watching these two clips, we can definitely say that both Sheree and Candy have not received their contracts for season 16 of The Real Housewives of Atlanta yet. And on that note, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another episode of Breaking News with G. And in this episode, I want to talk to you about the future of The Real Housewives of Atlanta, what's going on with season 16, and if I think that Sheree and Candy both will be coming back. But first of all, as usual, I have some commentary from The Mr. Housewives over there on Instagram. Shout out to him. Visit his page for the newest most breaking news. He has it all wrapped up really nicely. He writes, both housewives, former question mark, talked about the next season of the Real Housewives of Atlanta and if they would be on the show or not. Sheree Whitfield talked about the next season of Roa during her interview with Pride today, promoting the second season of The Traitors. We are still waiting to hear about casting, Sheree says. It's going to be a shakeup, which I'm okay with. I think it's needed. Sheree sounds fine not being asked back next season. She must be so used to getting fired. Child, <laughs> not the shade, honey. Candy Burris seems more frustrated with not knowing her status on the show. Bravo is tripping. They act like people don't have a life. Candy sounds like she knows she has been let go. I kind of have to agree. I know that many people want Eni Leakes and Portia Williams to return to the series, but unfortunately, that's not going to happen. We'll see about that. Obviously, Bravo and NBC will never employ Nini again, and Portia has no interest in returning to the show. I know many people didn't like season 15, but the terrible season was due to production and not the women. I think everyone from season 15 should return, including cousin Courtney. That would be an interesting storyline, especially with Drew Sedora being on the show. The Real Housewives of Atlanta season 16 plans to begin filming this spring. What are your thoughts? Comment down below. I'm going to read to you some comments that I found under the post that I think are interesting. So someone commented, Phaedra, Nini, Portia, Marlo, Kenya, Kim, and Cynthia. Sheree and LaToya as friends. That could be a cast, but LaToya, I think, has moved to Canada. So I don't think that's realistic. Someone else commented, really, Courtney, lol. Sheree, Candy, and Kenya are the only women that should return. Another one said, Sheree won't be on it. Candy will, be, Candy will because Andy said she's a fan favorite. They need Nene back. Hell, with all the drama with Kim and Croy, that's a storyline. Um, another one commented, I don't think we need Candy or Sheree, to be honest. I wish the show would come back with Drew, Kenya, and Portia as the center, and then three or four other ladies of different backgrounds and different connections. Candy is boring, and I'm saying that because she's not fun to watch. 
She's a successful woman and I applaud her for that, but I'm tired of her. She consistently misses events, cast trips, etc. And she never wants to get messy and I want to see messy on Atlanta. I'm indifferent with Sheree. I like her and I think she has potential, but I don't really know. Drew needs to stay, period. She should be the center storyline and Kenya needs to stay for her shade. And her storyline could be her new spa, but we need people who will also stand up to someone like Kenya also. Marlo goes below the belt. Listen up. Okay, I think it is ridiculous that production has spent so much time doing nothing. I mean, nothing was there in the last couple of months. Nothing was there in the sense that w where are the potential new housewives who are recasting why aren't we finding out anything? I've heard that maybe Tamar is going to participate in casting for the show. I wouldn't be mad at that. But I definitely think that Sheree sounds a little scared to lose her job. I'm not going to lie. She sounds a little shaky to me. Um, Candy sounds annoyed as always and at this point you know i like candy and all but i think if we want candy to stay on this show we need to reorganize her position i have been saying this and i have said this and i'll always say this candy is so busy that she barely has time to film I think she as a friend of to the show or as a part-time housewife with a quarter of her check and a quarter of the amount of episodes could be maybe a fit solution for her. I don't want to piss on anybody's like tree. I don't want to... Uh, speak ill into your blessings, but... Let's be honest here, this cast of season 15 cannot return. If Cousin Courtney comes back, I will be literally stabbing my eyes out with two forks. Um, I can't deal with her on the show. I think we need Drew, I think we need Kenya, I think we need Marlo. I think we need Sheree in some capacity. I think we need Kim Zolciak in some capacity because she has a lot going on and that gives all the other women a platform to, you know, harp on someone a little bit. You need to have the one whose personal life is a little wild and Kim Zolciak files for divorce every other week so i think this could be good and if she comes back as a friend and you give her i don't know 10 12 episodes and you give her that 25 30 35 40k an episode i don't think she would say no to that as well i have heard rumors of them trying to bring back nini I don't know how realistic that is because if they bring back Nini, um, majority of the budget, and if they also bring back Portia, which I would be ecstatic if these two would return, if they bring back, and the rumor is they're trying to allegedly, I don't know if this is fact, they're trying to allegedly bring back um, Nini, Portia, and Cynthia. Most of the budget would go to these three because they have been on the show for quite a number of years. I'd imagine that Nini would get the most, then Portia, then Cynthia, then Kenya. They'd all get around the two to at least 600K range, in my opinion. But... um. Manietta can go, Cousin Courtney can go, 
Sonia can definitely go. She's boring. I see her on a sports competition show, not Housewives. Beautiful woman, beautiful family, funny like sister, funny mom, but I just don't see it for her. We need to explore Drew's storyline a little bit. Um, I wouldn't be mad if they asked back Kenya's friend, Akila Escal. No, Escal was from Potomac. Some something with an A. She looked like, you know, she could bring it, and Nini, Portia, Cynthia would be a dream come true if they'd come back to the show. But yeah. Anyways, I'm excited to see the final cast of season 16. I think this is going to be the season where if production does not get it right, people are going to be like, shout out to everybody. This is the last time I'm tuning in. I had fun. Um, I, they could jeopardize the future of the show. Excuse Excuse me, I have like this internal little uh, choke. So yeah, I'll keep you guys updated if I find out more. I have a couple of sources that, you know, work in the production team at Bravo. Um, everybody's being very tight-lipped because there is not much movement going on in Atlanta. But as soon as I find out more, I will update you guys. And if they start filming in spring, we'll probably get a trailer by the end of summer. And we'll probably get the season October, September, maybe. If the season is dry and stale, they'll probably air it in August or July because they don't have much to work with. But I guess we'll just have to be patient, wait around, and see. Anyways, you guys, thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. What are your theories on this? Do you think Sheree and Candy will be back? Do you think they won't be back? Do you think they're fired? Let me know. Hit the notification bell down below, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.